I applied for the internship because I wanted to broaden the horizons regarding my future career choices and I also had a couple of passions that I hadn't fully discovered and researched about yet so I wanted to get some experience in those as well. So my internship is about mapping networks of non-fictional and fictional texts to find out um, how much of the networks are real and what are created, to find out characteristics about them and apply them to things like myths that we may have heard about and don't really understand in what context they're true. Uh, so far we're really in the preliminary process of, of gaining data and actually mapping the network before conducting any analysis. So right now I'm doing some simple data collection on the relationships between characters um, and the events in the story that occur um, in order to create that initial network. A difficulty I've experienced with the internship so far is that characterising relationships and stories is quite difficult and quite complex in, in terms of how you characterise something. Um, so my PI has been really, really good in supporting me in that and checking his answers against mine and going through the massive network list that I've created and making sure that I'm doing everything accurately and consistently. <laughs> oh, good. I hate one takes. From working on this project, uh, my future goals is to find out if I have a passion towards graph theory and maybe um, if I'd be better off doing something like, you know, theoretical graph analysis. I would apply for the internship because it's such a rare opportunity that uh, you get paid and you have so much support to, to carry out passions or to investigate what your future choices could be. Um, the internship allows you to be on the same level as the people that previously are your superiors and it really puts you on um, a better level with professionals and develops those relationships and contacts so that you can learn so much more about research for the future.